And what happens? I fish all around that point. I look to my left and think, okay, well, one last dash cast right on top of the rocks. I cast to the rocks. I didn't even engage the reel. All of a sudden there's weight. What happens is that little tail, when it's falling, that fish is on there to feed. And right away, one of the biggest fish of the day. Wow, as soon as it landed. It's a good one too. Wow. Wow. Oh yeah, another big black one. Oh my God, dude. Right on top of the top of the shoal, dude. Beautiful Brennan Harbor fat bass. Most times that hook finds its mark. It's got a good spot. Oh, he's big too. Holy cow. Unbelievable. As soon as it landed, don't go into that boat. Oh boy. He's big. He's mad. He's getting a little tired. Look at the size of this thing. Oh, he jumped into the net. Look at that thing. Does that beast make our day? Look where the hook placement is. Just in the corner. I told you these baits are incredible, man. Right on top of the shoal. Look at that. Just an absolute gorgeous example of smallmouth bass on the Whales Back Harbor off of Lake Huron. Man, I love Great Lakes smallmouth. Especially when they come in lakes like this, inland lakes as part of the resort here. Let's put them in the box. We'll let her go. But look at that. Isn't that a gorgeous fish? Man, I love these smallmouth. Just love them. Do I go to one more spot? Or do I say, you know what? Do I have a nap before I have dinner? Like I tell you, lots like, man. You got to do it. You just got to do it. Bucket list. This place here, Brennan Harbor, is one place to put on your bucket list. You know, you pick going down south, keep your wife happy, your girlfriend, your buddies. But you want to have a trip of a lifetime that you always remember catching kinds of fish like that right here. I'll go to Ontario. Go fish in Ontario because it's catching and it's so addictive. You just keep coming back year after year after year.